So now, I know you can't see it well, but what we have here is uh, kind of called an ideal diode. I would call it an almost ideal diode. So we have, out of 5 volts, about 4.9 volts across the load right there, which is just a resistor and then two LEDs that are wired as a polarity indicator. Make sure I get that in the right spot right there. And uh, so we're losing about 0.1 a volt out of 5 right there. But that's less than a diode would be. And the reason why I say that is I'm going to uh, pluck the positive supply and uh, we want to make sure we don't put both supply rails to the same spot. Um, but in case, I'm going to swap them right now, put the negative up on top, the positive on bottom, and you do see a voltage there, um, but that's just because uh, we're picking up uh, voltages along the way. No current is passing through the uh, transistor. If there was, the red LED would be glowing a little bit right there. So it's a diode, lets current flow one way, but not the other. So now we got a schematic diagram. The uh, green LED should be on. We have the P-channel enhancement mode MOSFET wired to be turned on when the gate is to the negative supply, although usually it's the source to the positive supply instead of the drain. And um, But uh, that's okay. So we get almost no voltage drop with the transistor with this setup. Green LED lights up pretty good. Now I'm going to swap the power pins, making sure they don't touch each other. That would cause a short circuit. Um, but again, we are across the whole circuitry again, like we were before. And there you can see the red LED did not light up. If current was flowing, the red LED would light up. We got positive down there, it would flow that way. But a uh, positive high enough voltage to the gate right there turns the transistor off. That's what this is wired right now is an off P-channel enhancement mode uh, MOSFET. So it's going to block current if the supply voltage is uh, that way. And it's going to let current flow pretty freely, um, better than a uh, diode uh, in this direction with that polarity.